Okay, I've downloaded Grade Supervisor onto my desktop in Windows 7. I'm going to double click the install file. First thing up is the end user license agreement. Take a look at that. And if acceptable, press I agree. I always turn on the demo files, check that on. And if you're evaluating the product, you're going to want those on so you can work with the files. Press next. Uh, the destination folder by default is Grade Supervisor. Each of the other products make their own folder. And also the data is stored in the C colon backslash data folder. Press next. This sets up a Grade Supervisor uh, folder. Next. And I just run full screen and put the desktop, uh, put the shortcut on the desktop. Install. So it'll take just a moment. Once the product is installed, you will be prompted with a close button, which I will do now. And here we have the grade supervisor icon. I'll move that over so we can take a look at that. So to load the package or to load the software, double click and up pops the main screen. Now, by default, these sample products uh, or sample data files are installed. And so in our next lesson, we'll simply take a tour around some of the buttons and some of the screens.